Hey guys, Nick Holding here, aka DVD Collector 96, and welcome to a new video on my YouTube channel. Okay guys, so happy Friday to you all. I hope you've been having a beautiful week so far. And I know I'm late with this video because this was released last Tuesday and I just got it this Tuesday, so it was a week late. I basically did the pre-order through Amazon and I don't know why they waited that long to ship it to me. Uh, and I saw people who were getting it earlier. I did went to my local Walmart to see if they have it on stock and they did have but they had the DVD edition which was like 14 and then the Blu-ray you could get it for 16 so I ended up waiting a little bit. I did save a lot of money because when I first did the pre-order it was like $50. I don't know why they start pre-orders with that crazy price which is never the ending price and I'm glad because Amazon always uh, respects whatever price she's cheaper but the time the movie gets out on release date that's the price they ended up charging. Now the TV show that we're talking about it's Interview with the Vampire, the complete first season on Blu-ray. Now, this is a show that I had a lot of fun watching it. And I know it's based on Ain Race, I wanna say, I don't wanna say the name incorrectly. Ain Rises. Uh, books, so for somebody who reads the book, maybe they were expecting this kind of show or whatever. Uh, a little behind the scenes, I did see the original interview with the vampire, the movie with Brad Pitt and Tom Cruise and the lady from Spider-Man when she was a little girl. Uh, I watched it because my mom and I, we love vampires. At that point I was watching The Vampire Diaries and she's like, oh, uh, you're going to enjoy this movie. I was living back in Cuba, so the quality for the movie was bad, really bad. And I keep waiting for that movie to get a 4K release, that's what I haven't added to my collection as a Blu-ray, but at this point I might even get it because I've, I've been waiting for a while. And uh, I went into YouTube and I have um, have this subscription, I love watching promos for TV shows and trailers, and they were promoting that they were going to do a show as an AMC stream, uh, streamer, sorry, uh, they were going to do the show, I saw the trailer. I love that. I love how everything looked and I was super excited about it. But I was like, you know what, I'm going to wait for the whole season to be complete. If I'm not mistaken, it's 10 episodes long. We're going to be checking this because I, wa I saw it on a weekend. I started watching it on Saturday and on Sunday I was on. Uh, the, let's call it 10 episodes for now. They went like this. They deliver you an epic season finale. And then uh, at the time I finished watching it, I got into Wikipedia and I know it's been renewed for a second season. There is already a few promotional pictures and I think there is a, not a trailer but a sneak peek I want to say. I don't know, I haven't watched it. Sometimes when I already know I love the show, I try not to watch the trailers. So I haven't watched it yet. If it's a trailer or there. Now, I'm always looking through Blu-ray.com and I'm always looking through Amazon because sometimes I found things and I'm like, oh wait, they're releasing this on physical media. They released this one and they released like seeing a witch uh, show as well. That one I haven't watched it just yet, but this one I was excited to add it to my collection. So again, like I said, I did the pre-order through Amazon and I don't know why it took that long. So let's go ahead and... Um, well, before we go ahead to the physical media release, this is a TV show that I already watched. So basically, it's different from the movie. Uh, basically, it's the same character since it's based on a book, but it's different. It's uh, the plots and everything, it's um, brought to modern days. Uh, the diversity of the cast, you're going to see a lot of strong scenes. There is a lot of, like, you know, what kind of scenes. Uh, there is like this devotion, but I think in this one they concentrated really good the relationship between the two main characters, not only the relationship between the little girl. And the little girl has been recast. They had to change the lady, I don't know why they had to change it. Um, at the time I reached the last scene, it was definitely like they planning to do more seasons because the way they end in the season, it ends on a cliffhanger and it's a really good one. But uh, out of 10, this show, I give it a 10. 
I enjoyed a lot. I didn't see any effects. Let's see if season two. <coughs> I'm sorry. Let's see if the second season uh, is as good as the first one, which sometimes not. Now, this is the Blu ray edition with a slip cover. Oh, it's falling down. Sorry. And uh, as you can see, the interview with the Vampire Rider it's uh, kind of in like 3D. Now, uh, this is the Blu ray edition. Uh, wait, what did I just say? This is the Blu ray piece of Ain Rises Interview with the Vampire Season 1. Lush and Entrailing, the Collider, and as you can see here is an AMC release. I love to have a garden so early, oh, that the, their eyes shine as well, that's a beautiful touch. So this is how it looks in the front, on the spine, you basically have uh, an information card that says you have a two blur, two Blu-ray this set, the title of the show, and this is how it looks in the back. Now. The best and price adaptation ever made. It's really good, but I still enjoy more the movie. Uh, in the year 2022, the vampire Louise de Pointe du Lac, Jacob Anderson, seeks to tell the story of his life, or afterlife, to renowned journalist Daniel Molloy Eric Bogosian. Beginning in early 20th century New Orleans, which I haven't visited that city, I'm dying to go to that later, but I'm sorry. <laughs> Louis' story follows his relationship with the vampire Lestat de Leoncourt, Sam Ray, those two characters' amazing chemistry, and their former family, including Ken, Fledglin, Claudia, Ballet, Bass. Together, the vampire family endures immortality in New Orleans and beyond. One of the different scenes as well is that in this one, the little girl doesn't look as, as little as they did on the movie. Uh, lively, fresh, wickedly funny, and intensely erotic San Jose Mercury News. This is certified on fresh rotten tomatoes, and as a special feature, I always hope to get physical media releases with special features. Uh, in this case, we get the 2022 San Diego Comic Con panel, and then you can see here they use promotional pictures on the bottom part. Now, you can get the DVD edition as well. But like I said, the DVD edition, I think it was like 14, and then you can get the Blu-ray for 16. So for me, I prefer to go with the Blu-ray. Let's see now. So basically, the front looks the same. Let's see the back. And the back looks the same as well. Shrink wrap, let's go ahead and take out the shrink wrap for this beauty. It's a regular Blu-ray uh, disc. Taking up the string wrap. I love having TV shows in Blu ray. So, string wrap is out. That's how it looks with the string wrap. That's how it looks in the bottom, in the back, sorry. Let's see now if they surprise us and they use uh, art for the Blu rays. And they did. So basically, this one doesn't come with digital because they're suggesting you to create your AMC account. Only the good stuff. Go to amcplus.com, create your account, enter code HALF OF 2022 to get AMC Plus for 50 of your subscription. I'm going to be leaving you guys the codes just in case you're interested. And it basically shows that they have a really uh, great collection. I can see titles that I know there, uh, The Walking Dead and Fear the Walking Dead. To be honest, those are the, the only two that I recognize. And they did create cover art for the disc, even if it's the same as the front cover art, still, I, that's, that's a win for me. So basically, this one with episodes 1 to 4, and these two with episodes 5 to 7, plus the special feature 2022 San Diego Comic Con panel. As you can see, that information is right there, and right there. So now that I have this release on my collection, I'm super excited to get into season two. I think it's coming out in December. I don't even, I'm not even sure if there is a release date out there, but there might be. I need to check into that. Let me know in the comments if you watch the show and if you enjoy it. And if you haven't watched the show, go ahead and watch it. And let me know as also if you have watched the original movie, which I love that original movie. 
But for now, that will be all for today's video. Like I always say, I hope you guys are enjoying this series you're gonna go down in the channel. If you are, please let me know in the comments, leave me a like, and please subscribe to my YouTube channel so we can keep this from enjoying. And see you guys again soon on a new video.